I didn't quite understand why my mom insisted on this, but there was no escaping it. Every morning, I reluctantly went through the routine of putting on makeup and squeezing into dresses. It was a far cry from the comfortable jeans and t-shirts I longed to wear. I often felt like an imposter, pretending to be someone I wasn't. My little brother, oblivious to the strange situation, went on with his life, and mom continued to refer to me as his older sister. It was clear that she wanted a daughter to dress up and bond with, and that daughter was going to be me. As I looked at myself in the mirror, struggling with mascara and lipstick, I couldn't help but wonder if mom's intentions were misguided. I wished she could understand that I needed the freedom to be myself, to explore the world in my own way. But for now, I was trapped in this uncomfortable charade, trying to make the best of a situation that made no sense to me. Over time, I begrudgingly accepted my role as the older sister, to my little brother, even though it wasn't my choice. As I continued to wear makeup and dresses at home and in public, something unexpected started to happen. I began to learn more about the world from a different perspective. I understood the effort and care that went into being a woman, and it made me more empathetic towards the women around me. Mom's intention may have been to make me aware of the challenges women face in a man's world, and in a way, it was working. I started to appreciate the strength and resilience of the women who navigated this world every day. My relationship with my brother also began to change. As his sister, I found myself sharing more with him. We bonded in a way we hadn't before, and I was able to offer him a different perspective on life. It was an unexpected silver lining in this unusual situation. While I still longed for the freedom to dress and express myself as I wished, I couldn't deny that this experience was shaping me in ways I hadn't anticipated. I was becoming more feminine in appearance, but I was also becoming a more understanding and compassionate sibling to my brother. It was a complex journey, one I was still trying to make sense of, but it was teaching me valuable lessons along the way. As time went on, I found myself embracing the role of an older sister, more wholeheartedly. It wasn't just about dressing the part, it was about behaving like one too. I began to take on responsibilities that an older sister might have. I helped my little brother with his homework, offering guidance and support. We played games together, and I listened to his stories about school and friends, just like a sister should. I also started offering advice and insights, drawing from my unique perspective of experiencing both worlds. It was strange yet fulfilling to guide him through life's challenges, sharing the lessons I had learned about empathy and understanding during this journey. Our relationship deepened, and I realized that I wasn't just playing a role. I was becoming a better sibling, more compassionate and caring. My little brother, despite the initial confusion, began to appreciate having an older sister, who could relate to him on a different level. The experience of living as a girl in a man's world, as my mom put it, had broadened my horizons and made me a more well-rounded individual. While I still had my own struggles and uncertainties about my identity, I was grateful for the opportunity to bond with my brother in a unique way and to gain a deeper understanding of the complexities of life as a woman.